welcome to you all at home for this afternoon's uh, what promises to be a thrilling gridlock derby. It's the eighth time that these two clubs have met each other and Eastern Suburbs are yet to register a single victory. This match will be under the watchful guidance of Matt Conger and his uh, referee team of Mark Rule and Tavita Marcassini. And he'll have his hands full here today as uh, Eastern Suburbs go in search of their first victory over Auckland City. Auckland City applying uh, the blowtorch here to Eastern Suburbs who are trying to play out. They've uh, played their way into trouble here as Allison flashes a shot wide of the target. Lovely quick feet to find Hoyle. Hoyle not quite able to reciprocate, but uh, Dylan de Jong is clipped by Brian Keltak and uh, Matt Conger says that's uh, the second. I don't think there's going to be a reprieve next time. No. And again, Brian Keltak a bit sloppy. Howard dancing past Mitchell. Clipped into the far post. Great ball. Buono! And uh, Connor Tracy was in the right place at the right time. A lovely move from Eastern Suburbs and almost the first goal of this game. Well, that's a good run by Lewis if he's uh, stayed on side. And great goalkeeping from Daniel Drake. Very brave. There was a moment's hesitation in the Lily White's defence that uh, saw Lewis exploit it. It hasn't been a derby game in the classic sense where there's been uh, clattering tackles, but the feeling is uh, certainly intense. Here's Hoyle blocked by Caltech. Well, free kick for Eastern Suburbs. 30 seconds to go in the first 45, and there's a tussle for the ball here between Howison and Adam Thomas. There's a lot of feeling out there. Temperature just starting to rise here in Sandringham. It'd be an ideal time for the visitors to get on the score sheet. Two minutes of additional time to be played at the end of uh, the first half. Something special right at the end of the half. Awad. That's a good ball in. Oh, and Bono goes down, and uh, there's a question asked by Adam Thomas. But uh, from the rest of the Lily White's players, it was uh, rather half hearted or not interested at all, which tells its own story. That time, Peyton Lewis got some freedom in the box, did, chose not to go onto his left foot, and ultimately the attack broke down. He couldn't combine with Jordan Vale. Oof, and that wasn't far away. It all seemed to happen in slow motion there. Daniel Drake picked it up late. Blake, David Brown, tries to work across, and he does well. Uh, Oh, and that was a very, very canny <laughs> defending from uh, Christian Craig. Talk about composure. I think There's no good. shortage of pressure, but my word. Good run from Rogerson. And Ali blazes the shot high over the crossbar. I mean, that's a good shot, isn't he? Very competent piece of goalkeeping. Andrew Blake, who showed us a couple of weeks ago what he's capable of on that right foot from distance. And that big right paw comes out to help the ball over the crossbar. Oh, lovely there oh. from yes. Vale. Very clever from Vale. As we see here, lovely two touch from Jordan Vale there. Size for Thomas. Drake caught late by Yusuf Ali. Oh, and uh, a shot from distance. Oh, and so very nearly. Daniel Drake does have this habit of uh, sitting outside his penalty <laughs> box. He knows it. Well, dear, oh, dear. You can see the funny side of it now. They're coming together of Reed Drake and Ali. Took my attention. I wasn't even sure who hit it, but Cam Howison just centimeters away. Blake still has uh, possession for Auckland. Away by Solomons. It's uh, bouncing around and uh, Blake, uh, sorry, Bevan couldn't get enough power on the shot and Daniel Drake clutches that ball gratefully to his chest. And that will be the final act in the gridlock derby. And uh, 
warm exchange of uh, handshakes and embraces for players of both teams in what has been a fascinating match to call for you this afternoon at Kiwatia Street. Yeah, it was, it was a lot about just getting together and battling and, and riding out, uh, dragging each other along. That was a big focus this week because um, that, that helps to win games, that kind of um, attitude and work rate. So that was a big, big focus this week. You know, uh, obviously always coming up against the Eastern Suburbs, it's a, it's, a, it's a fighting battle and you know you've got to give all for 95 minutes and I thought both teams put it out there and um, showed the people that came out and watched and hopefully on telly that they enjoyed the game but yeah you can feel it on the body now for sure.